What's up guys, welcome back to another Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War video. In today's video we're going to be talking about the reveal event for Black Ops Cold War that will be happening in Warzone on Wednesday, August 26th. So we actually got start times for this so we know exactly when to be in Warzone for this. I mean previously we just like knew, okay, August 26th, does they tell us a time? No, we'll actually we finally know times for that as well as a few other details about it. But first, before we get into that, I want to remind you guys to subscribe to the channel if you're new around here. Make sure you guys have that notification bell ring that you guys don't miss out on any more Black Ops Cold War videos. Now we guys stay updated with all the latest information and news on the game. So without further ado, let's get into it. So first off for today, let's talk about the Black Ops Cold War trailer. So Activision has published another teaser trailer for Black Ops Cold War. Now these are all just like cinematic trailers. These aren't anything like directly from the game, right? Like this isn't like gameplay. This isn't like a multiplayer trailer or something like that. But uh, this is just kind of setting up the premises for the game and kind of the plot and like the era that this game is in, obviously showcasing like Cold War and stuff. But the full length trailer, because like they posted a full length trailer, then they did like a minute long one, then they did like another minute long one. So the full length trailer that was posted through Pawn Takes Pawn, through that whole Easter egg process on that website with finding out the reveal for Black Ops Cold War, we actually got access to that teaser video. Now, in that video, it was really interesting because there was one second of footage, one whole second of footage showing the Tiananmen Square massacre, and because of that, the full-length teaser trailer has been blocked in China. So, if you guys don't know, China likes to block that sort of stuff. They're really hard on censorship on that particular topic, so because of that, Activision went ahead and basically edited it out, made like a one-minute video, and uploaded that, and that is now available for viewers in China. So, kind of interesting though that Activision is eliminating that out from it. They're like, oh, oops, well, yeah, we definitely want people in China to be able to see our game, but let's uh, totally edit out this part of history. But that's not here what we're talking about. I just thought it was kind of interesting. That was something with the reveal that was kind of notable. But now let's actually talk about the reveal event that's going to be happening within Warzone for Black Ops Cold War. So Activision finally detailed start times for this event. So we kind of assumed it would probably be like the same start times that we had for like the, the, the actual like the Warzone events with the Pawn Takes Pawn. Every day, you know, we logged in at 12 o'clock Eastern time and that's when you got, you know, a new update to the website, we got a new tape, and we got new things from Warzone. Well, it's actually different than that, so they confirmed, like, actual start times for this, and they detailed different time zones for this. So, also, if your specific time zone is not in here, you can just drop a comment down below, and our fantastic community, I'm sure, will be able to help. But when will this review happen in Warzone? Well, it'll start, as we know, on Wednesday, August 26th, but it'll start at 10.30 a.m. Pacific Time, so that is 11.30 a.m. Mountain, 12.30 p.m. Central, and 1.30 p.m. Eastern Time. That also makes it 6.30 p.m. in the UK, and also 7.30 p.m. for the next time zone in Europe. And then it will be on Thursday, August 27th at 2.30 a.m. JST and 3.30 a.m. AEST. And along with these start times, Call of Duty on Twitter also posted a video about this event. So it's kind of interesting. They say, know your history, and they have a bunch of stuff blocked out. August 26th, Verdansk, 10.30 a.m. Pacific time. So this is what that video they showed off over on Twitter is. So it's kind of interesting, so it shows the spy plane fly over, it has like demoralization, you know, it has stuff from the actual teaser trailer that we got that showed up on here, and then also just has like the, the war zone drop plane, you know, everybody drops out of flying over too, so kind of interesting, I don't know, I mean, maybe it's kind of setting up the whole thing that we're going to be getting like a new war zone map for Black Ops Cold War, or new updates for it or stuff like that, like we know that's happening, so maybe that's kind of what we're going to be getting teased within here. But that's the other thing too, is but they haven't said anything about, okay, well, where in Verdansk? Where in Warzone? Are we, you just boot up the menu? You just boot up in a game? What happens? What happens at 10.30 a.m. Pacific time in Warzone? We don't know. They just say Verdansk. So we're just assuming, just make sure you are inside of a match on that. I would recommend playing Plunder because everybody in regular Battle Royale is super sweaty and likes to try hard in that. But at least in Plunder, that's where people like to go for like these Easter eggs and, and doing these things. So... Try and play like a game of plunder, be in a match at about 10.30 a.m. And we're just going to have to see what happens. So I'm going to be streaming it on my channel, guys. Make sure you guys have notifications on there. You guys don't miss out on that because I know a lot of you guys have school or work or stuff like that. So if you're not able to view it yourself, make sure you guys tune into that stream. So that way you guys can actually see what happens 
and see what this reveal is going to be. So that's going to do it for the video today, guys. Thank you all so much for watching. Let me know your guys' thoughts on this in the comments down below. There we go. We have start times for the actual reveal that's going to be happening within Warzone, as well as a kind of interesting story that happened with the teaser trailer and how it was banned in China as well. So thank you all so much for watching. Let me know your guys' thoughts on this in the comments down below, and I'll see you in the next video.